car. Now, there's some real innovation going on here. Could be a world first. It is a world first. This is Todd. He's from Sun Scout. Now, what we're going to look at and talk about here is they've taken an existing electric van. They have solar powered it up. It is go it's completely charge and run itself and run the full motorhome once it's kitted out. Is that what we're doing here, Tom? That's exactly right. So we've taken yeah, an electric LDV van, has an 86 kilowatt internal battery in its drive. We've put 5.2 kilowatts of solar across the bodywork and on these projecting wings here. Uh, and that will regenerate 150 kilometers of drive range per day. Uh, and at the same time, power all of your leisure appliances. So having such a phenomenally large battery, we can have induction cooktops, incinerating toilets, compressor fridges, microwaves, fill your boots, um, you know, charge your e-bikes as well. Um, and the idea is, you drive a couple of hours, you get to your destination, you park up for three days, the solar system fully regenerates the range of the van and powers every conceivable appliance inside. Right. So this is a concept, we can't show you an inside at the moment, but we look over here, we have the renderings and ideas, it'll be fitted out. There are customizations and things that you can talk through and choose as you develop. You see you've got your bed, shower, toilet. Washing machine. Washing machine, that's pretty cute. A good size compressor fridge, microwave. Kitchen's a good looking kitchen. I look forward to seeing the actual model, but let's talk about you guys. Tell us about you and how you develop this technology and the why. Yeah, so we've seen that there's a massive hole in the market for sustainability. We've hit a very interesting intersection where lithium batteries are cheap, they're affordable now. Solar panels, cheapish, yes. Solar panels are incredibly efficient. The efficiency with getting on these flexi panels is 23%. Um, so all these things have kind of converged at once and they make these things achievable now. So yeah. there's there's space in the market for people to sell sustainable travel. Um, have you got an electrical history, a solar history, you're a car fan, what are you? What are <laughs> so, you, Tom? Uh, our owner, Edwin, he's a dinosaur of the uh, electrical solar industry. He's been in it for about 30 years. Yeah. Uh, he's been working on this concept for a few years now. So. We've also got the solar-powered robotic lawnmowers. He was the first person in the world yes, to I saw a, that. Bruce is fully... interested in that. <laughs> yeah, he's the first person to have a fully self-sustaining solar robotic lawnmower. Um, we've got one that does a thousand square meters a week, a hectare a week, and then ten hectares a week. So uh, that sounds you can fantastic. target your, your facilities management and councils. Okay. Now, what's your website that we can pop up so people can find out a little bit more information and start to get into maybe talking to you about what you can do for them and what they can do for you? Yes, our website is www.sunscout.co.nz. It's fantastic. You've had a good show. What sort of money are we going to be looking at for a need product? Just a little bit of a guideline, maybe. Yeah, so to meet the market, we've got to price it to a conventional van. So they range anywhere between that kind of 150 to 170 mark. That's Depending on how sit. you spec it up. Exactly. Awesome. Yeah. Right. Fantastic, it's nice to see some innovation. I personally think if you've got an electric vehicle, why the heck shouldn't it be charging itself up one way or the other? So this is fantastic. Thank you so much for your time, no Tom. You. We look forward to profiling a bit more of this and this company in the future in NZ Today RV Lifestyle Magazine. That was another great video from NZ Today RV Travel Lifestyle Magazine. Subscribe and follow our channel for more great videos. Follow us on Facebook. Thanks for your support.